changes to your amazing body. So this afternoon's lesson is going to be about puberty. Does anybody know what that means? Please miss, can we stay in at lunchtime to put puberty on the computer? Can you remember the talk we had on internet safety? Yes, yes miss. Search engine, see what we can find on the internet. What should I type in first? Puberty. Yes, I think that should be okay. Oh look, there should be like explanations to click on. You have gone through a lot of changes already to get to the last stage of growing up called puberty. From a tiny baby, you have managed to learn how to sit up, crawl, and then walk. As you have grown, you have learned to do lots of other things, such as ride a bike or kick a ball. Let's click on this diagram and see what a period is. We girls have our sex organs safely tucked away on the inside of our bodies. We have two ovaries which contain hundreds of unripe eggs. They have been there since we were born. During puberty, the ovaries start to work and produce the female hormone oestrogen. Due to this, the ovaries produce a ripe egg which travels from the ovary to the womb. The egg, no bigger than a pinhead, travels down the fallopian tube to the womb. At the same time, the womb grows a thick lining. This is a special lining because if the egg was to meet a sperm, it would become fertilised and would stick to the lining of the womb and start to grow into a baby. Most of the time, the egg will not be fertilised and there is no use for this lining. The lining then breaks down and slowly comes out of the womb through the vagina. This is what's called a period or menstruation. There isn't a lot of blood. It's about three to four tablespoons or 45 millilitres. Periods can last anything from two to eight days. To find out where your vagina is, you could use a hand mirror. You'll find the opening to the vagina in between the legs. The vagina is protected by two flaps of skin. In between your legs, there are several openings. First of all, there is a sensitive bump called the clitoris. Further down is the urethra. This is the tube that leads to our bladder where we store urine. The next opening is the vagina where the period blood comes out. Further around from the vagina is the anus, the opening to our bowels. That reminds me, I'd better go. I've got a party to go to. See us.